Hi friends, welcome to Dining with Diamonds. My name is Em and welcome back to another very special unboxing here on the channel. Yay! Um, <laughs> I apologize that I have been very, very quiet out here in the internet space. Um, this has been a very difficult year <laughs> for me uh, personally, uh, but uh, I was reached out to by this lovely brand, Craft Ease. Um, and they wanted to send me um, a painting from their website so I can review and share with you. So it's very exciting. And I've never tried crafties before. I know they've been floating around in the ether. So I'm excited to see what we have here today. If you're new to this channel, hi, hello, welcome. I'm so happy you're here. Uh, if you would like to, please consider giving the video a like if you enjoy and consider subscribing to the channel uh, because eventually... <laughs> I will be back. Um, fair warning, I just am not sure when uh, I will be posting consistently again. Um, but it will start with a whip and chat video, I can tell you that, okay? And if you are returning, hi! I miss you all very, very much. Um, so, I want to get right into this unboxing. We've got a little bit of a beat up box, but we'll get into it. I had to rip off the um, packaging that this came in because it had my address all over it and I was like there is no point in me wasting my energy just to cover up the addresses all over it so I decided to just <laughs> just open it and get it over with um but yeah so I'm very excited um we've got a really nice painting in here crafty ease not only has diamond paintings but paint by numbers they have a warehouse in both the US and in China um, this kit, I believe, did come from China. It took about a month to get here, uh, because I believe Crafties reached out to me, ooh, maybe three and a half weeks ago. Uh, so, like, almost a month it took to get here. Um, and it was wrapped in just a plain old, um, uh, bag, <laughs> which is why I think it got beat up. However, it did have fragile written all over it, so I'm blaming it on the postal system. Although... I would say I would recommend that possibly getting um, a better way to ship the canvases would be beneficial so the boxes don't end up looking so beat up. It makes me very sad. It just makes me very sad. But I hope and I'm sure the painting is all right in here and I'm excited to see it. Um, but that's just a little, that's like a little nitpicky thing on my end. Um, but I'm very, very excited. Thank you again, Craft Ease, for sending me this painting and let's take a look oh okay <laughs> not much in this box that's fine just a little painting um wrapped in plastic uh but it is branded we have a nice branded box i'm a little out of the game here so <laughs> i'm terribly sorry if i'm like all over the place so we have everything that this kit includes on the box which is very nice um and we also have nice branding on it as well. So Crafties knows what they're doing, which is very nice. All right, let's just open up this little, <laughs> this little plastic. I'm ripping it, which is, which is not ideal, but it's fine. <laughs> so I decided to get Numiko, I think it's called Numiko. Oh my goodness, I'm gonna look so silly if that's not what it's called. Numiko, I'm <laughs> thank goodness I'm correct. That would have been so embarrassing. Um, and this is a glow in the dark kit. Oh, how cute is this? It's by Civil Art. Uh, Craft Ease does license their artwork, which is so nice. How adorable and tiny is this? I honestly not expecting it to be this small okay hold on let me roll it the other way really quickly um since it came rolled let's roll it this way rolling 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 the canvas back so we can get it to lay flat and woo okay so that didn't do much but <laughs> it's a little crumpled but it's all right it's fine so this kit doesn't have scalloped edges, which is in itself not a big deal, but it is going to start fraying in the corners just a little bit. But 
I'm sure it's fine. So this is Numiko by Sybil Arts. Um, we've got some branding down here and socials. We also have some branding in the corner and then the legend on the side. It's sweet, it's simple, it's to the point. <laughs> Doesn't need much more than that. So I'm a super silly goose and I'm probably gonna splice this right in the middle <laughs> of the video. That way it doesn't get lost in translation at the end because it's been a while. I'm not sure entirely what I'm doing anymore. <laughs> I'm going to talk extensively about how this is a glow in the dark kit. It's not, it's just got ABs and the ABs are the electric drills in the kit. That's it. Um, this is also a 30 centimeter by 50 centimeter. And that's interesting to me because it does not look like that um so i'm gonna do a quick measurement because i think it might be from edge to edge and not the entire like the actual pasting area uh so i have my um i have my little measuring tape here and i just want to measure i'm gonna go on the centimeter side because that makes the most sense oh okay oh i'm pleasantly surprised all right, it is 30 by 50, or at least it's 30. The pasting area is 30 centimeters. It seems lengthwise. Hold on, let me do it one more time just to make sure I'm not doing this incorrectly. Lengthwise, it's 49 centimeters, which is super interesting. Um, so it's not exactly true to size. It's almost, it's about a centimeter off lengthwise, but it is um, 30 centimeters uh width wise which is fine this is also a really nice uh kit if you are looking for something a little bit cheaper i believe this kit is 38 dollars which i think is a great price uh a great price for licensed artwork um so yeah i'm gonna go right back to the video now so i believe this is a glow in the dark kit um craft ease has a whole bunch of kits on their website that are glow in the dark and I really wanted one of them that was. <laughs> and of course she's a mermaid, so it was like the perfect, the perfect opportunity for, for that. Um, so I am not sure. Oh, oh my. So we've got drills in here and we have like electric drills in here. Okay, I don't know if those are the ones that glow in the dark. I have no idea. I am clueless <laughs> at this point. And we also have a very standard and basic toolkit. We've got a boat, we've got two squishies, we've got wax, and we've got two pens and two tweezers. Just in case you wanna do a painting with a buddy, I guess. I love that. Okay, so let's look at these drills. Okay. I'm curious, I don't know if I'm gonna know which ones are glow in the dark or not. Because on this legend here, we can see that number five, which is 23 here, um, is 23. It's not a DMC number. And then we also have the same thing for number 22 here. So I don't know if those are the glow in the dark drills or just the electric ones. I would, I, I honestly am not sure. <laughs> I couldn't tell you. I couldn't tell you. Okay, so let's look at these colors. This kit has some of my favorite colors in here. It is round. I honestly was not sure <laughs> if this was a round or a square drill kit, but these drills are definitely round. So let's take a peek. So we have, I don't know if these are, yes. Okay, so these are DMC coated, but the bag doesn't say what DMC um, these colors are, which in and it of itself is not a huge deal, but they are on the legend. So it's, not a huge deal. Okay, so we've got a lot of pretty purples. And then we have this electric drill. I don't know if these are the glow-in-the-dark ones or not. I might never know. I don't know. Do these glow-in-the-dark? I'm not sure. But they're cool. Even if they don't, they're really cool. Um, that looks like some 310. And we have some pinks. Ooh. I love the pinks and the oranges and greens. This is a very fun and colorful canvas. Um, I do wish it was a little bit bigger. I feel like the, um, the rendering might get lost in translation a little bit, but I guess we'll just have to see. Uh, but she's so cute though. I think this is so cute. I might have to flatten it 
under my bed a little bit because it's got some it's got some wrinkles going on. Okay, okay, so we have more of these electric looking drills here. And I am just unsure <laughs> at this point. I am just unsure. Um so let's see, let me show you. We've got this blue electric drill. I almost wonder if these if they glow. I, I I'm not sure. I believe this one's a glow in the dark. Maybe it just has electric drills. <laughs> I have no idea. We have some more purples and we have some blues. And then we have one more. Oh my goodness. There's a lot of these. Oh, that's exciting. I want to see where these fun drills go. So I'm just going to stick these bags of drills back into their little plastic sheath from once they came. And I will be right back. Okay, so I want to see where these fun electric drills are going to go. Um, now that I have come to realize that they are not uh, glow-in-the-dark drills, but they're electric drills. So that symbol T, which is the green fun electric drill there, is all in these hearts and these little blobs here. Oh, I think that's the inside of a flower, not a blob. My bad. And we've got stars and more hearts. So any place that has that electric green color, like here, here, and all over the place, it's pretty evenly spread out throughout the canvas, which is really nice. These stars too. This little bubble up here as well. So there's a decent amount of that, which is super fun. So then we have this blue, which is like a little crescent moon. So I'm going to get that confused with the Z. So I'm going to try my best to, to not do that. So we have some of that in that bubble. Um, I got to hunt around. We have some of that inside this little bubble. Um, around in this area as well. And over here. And then we have some of that in this bubble here. And also up here in that little bubble. So not a whole lot of that one, but still like, oh, 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 I missed some. We also have that in her eyes, oh, which is going to be so cute. That'll be so cute. And then we have this white electric drill, which is like this, um, this star looking symbol. I always equate that to like the North Star. So it looks like the North Star. Um, and we have two bags of that. So let's see, let's see where we can find that. Okay. So that is in her face over here. I'm actually not sure how that will turn out, but that will be interesting to see. We have that lining her face as well on this side. We have that coming down onto, um, under her little body here. We have all those white electric drills. Um, and we also have some over here by her hair and then a whole lot probably the majority of them are up in this area above her right here so there's a decent amount of funness going on in this kit which makes me very excited this is a great snack sized kit um perfect to pull out <laughs> when you don't want to work on all of those uh really really large canvases <laughs> Um, however, I'm a little nervous that she might get a little lost in translation because she is on the tinier side and there's a lot of little details going around, floating around here. Um, but I'm still really curious to see, uh, how it will work up. Also, really quick, that's sticky. It is sticky, so that's fine. We don't have to worry about that. I will have to put it, like, under something flat so it doesn't have these, uh, these fun little creases in it because uh, <laughs> that gets a little annoying trying to work on a canvas like that but that's super easy to circumvent you just stick it under your mattress for a little bit and then it should be all right if you would like to purchase this kit um i have a link down below which is an affiliated link which is very exciting so thank you craft ease for providing that if you want to check out the full lineup of either sybil arts uh collection of diamond paintings on that website or their paint by numbers or anything um you can click that link in the description below uh to go to the website if you do make a purchase from that link however i just want to let you know that i may make a small commission from it um i don't have a code to share with you 
as far as I'm aware of. But that link is an affiliated link. And I just wanted to let you all know that. I think this is a great kit to work on if you are on a budget, which <laughs> a lot of us are in these trying times, gas prices being what they are. Um, so if you're looking for a kit on the smaller side that is licensed artwork, I think this is a great company to go to and it won't break the bank. Um, I do want to thank Crafties again for sending me this kit to review for you all. Uh, I hope you are all having a super duper lovely week. Um, I hope to be making videos consistently for you again, but I am so happy to uh, be able to make this video for you now. Um, I hope you all have a wonderful morning, afternoon, evening, night, whenever it is you are watching this, and thank you so much for supporting me on my diamond painting journey, and I will see you all in my next video. Bye!